The role of technology in schools today is very much different than it was 20 years ago. If you look at all the largest companies in the world, Apple, Microsoft, Google, it's all technology driven uh, services companies and that's the way the world is moving and that's the way that agriculture is going to move in the future as well we believe and that's why we are involved in technology solutions for the agriculture sector. We are excited about today because today we, we open our cattle facility where we can teach our kids everything about uh, the handling of uh, cattle, uh, herefords, and the whole uh, facility is automated and we can keep track of all the information of each and every cattle in our stud. It is important because it creates more opportunities for our learners and it broadens their, their world. RFID is a technology-driven service company that belongs to BKB and the way that they are involved is giving infrastructure, the physical tags and the physical what you see here today, but also behind that also the software and the, the way that um, you use this technology because technology is in a way or the data is useless if you can't use it for yourself and we believe that technology will be used to solve problems and in this case RFID is, is responsible to assist the farmer in to solve livestock problems. Our involvement here today is that we provided the funding for this crawls. We talked to RFID and we installed it uh, we started a year ago with it and the reason for investing this amount of money in this crawls is that we need to skill learners so that when they leave school they have the skills that somebody needs so they must be employable. We work on the learners curriculum vitae by giving extra skills like this RFID crawls and other certificates but the learner don't only have a grade 12 certificate you also have skills that somebody needs. We invested also at six other schools. We invested about 12 million in them. So from the Western Cape Education Department side, it's, it's totally the, it's worth the investment that we're doing in our learners. Because we want learners that can be employable to the private sector. RFID experts designed the, the handling facility and we're also responsible for the building and the installation. And then also what we do is we do the full training for the kids and also for the school and all the relevant parties that will be working with the, with the devices. This is a three-way cattle auto drafter. It works with RFID technology in combination with visual tags that we apply to every cow and, and bull. On this system you can then record all sorts of uh, uh, information about the animal. For instance, the date of birth, who's the father, who's the mother, um, you can record weights, you can, um, and then you can also draft in different directions. So we can, for instance, draft on, on, on weight, specifically male, female, or any other um, criteria that you would like to. The system can work up to 400 cattle in an hour and a half. The, the scale is equipped with, with sensors that will actually check if the cow is in the crate, and then it will automatically close the gates. And the information then afterwards that you've collected uh, can be uploaded into a cloud database or it can be loaded into a management software like Bengu Farm uh, Cattle uh, and Bengu Farm Beef and you can then uh, manipulate your data and you can actually load the data back onto the scale to execute your management decisions. What makes this technology unique is the fact that the system is fully integrated with the management software. So. You don't have to write down any data anymore. You can actually just plug it into your computer and, and electronically transfer the data uh, onto your management system and backwards. Uh, it eliminates mistakes. It, it assists you to identify good performing animals as well as bad performing animals. And it helps you to select your top performers fairly quickly. With problems like foot and mouth disease, 
uh, what this technology does, it logs all vaccinations, it logs your dipping records, um, and it can also be transferred into the software and it keeps a full record of, of all the animals that's been treated for that specific disease. And this makes it credible as it can also be uploaded into a blockchain in the future. But it's also important to take our learners to, together with us. Uh, it doesn't help we put this here and they don't understand that world. So they will, this will enable them to not only understand the physical dynamics of it, but they will also learn about the digital dynamics of it. And hopefully in a few years from now, we will see the next Steve Jobs coming from one of these schools where we are involved. And we are very excited to be involved in that. We believe that that kind of training is, is a partnership. It's a partnership between uh, some, someone like BKB and the school and the Department of Education. And we believe that's the, that's the way the future will go.